Hello and welcome to another episode of Coffee Fusion. This week we're going to look at how to pour the simple heart. Alright guys, so some of you have been asking how to pour a simple uh, latte art heart. Uh, so I thought this week we'd um, just cover that. Uh, it's a really simple pattern, but it's really good to practice actually, especially when you start um, pouring some more difficult patterns, to come back and pour the simple ones again and really work on things like your contrast and your uh, symmetry. So uh, let's have a look at how to pour the latte art heart. So the main thing with any latte art, obviously, but when you're uh, getting started with the basics, is to pull yourself a really good shot and texture your milk really well. So let's start off by doing that. Alright guys, so in order to set a really good base of espresso, we have to um, have some consistency, okay? So, uh, you can see here, I've got my um, scales, and I always dose 19 grams for my espresso machine. I keep that really nice and consistent, and then that way, um, when I need to change a variable, I'm just changing the coarseness or the fineness of the grind to get that really good extraction. we're talking milk steaming, um, always start with a nice clean jug, uh, really fresh cold milk uh, from a uh, really high quality dairy. Okay, add some air in to raise about half a centimetre to a centimetre in the volume of the jug. And then just tap the side of the jug till you bring it up to temperature. We're aiming for about 60 to 65 degrees. Okay guys, so you've got a really good base um, and you've got some really silky milk. So now, what we want to do is set the crema and get your canvas started. Alright, so you've set that canvas really well and you're about three quarters of the way up. Now you want to lower your jug closer to the crema and start pushing in that heart. First of all, when you're pouring a basic heart, you just want to slowly move that jug. Don't wiggle at all, let the milk do the work and let it start wrapping around on itself. Okay, now you're closer to the top, you want to push the tip of your jug in to create the top of the heart. And now lift up the jug and pull through. Let's take a look at a few more examples and variations. There's the fundamentals for creating a uh, latte art heart. So now it's time for you to practice. And what we'll do this week is we'll have uh, Freeport Friday being heart designs only. So you guys have a chance to practice and then get your designs up for Freeport Friday. Speaking of Freeport Friday, let's take a look at how the finals went this week and who ended up taking it out. Okay guys, so it's been a few weeks since I've uh, had a video. So we've actually got the last three winners here. Um, we've got Jervis, Alex and Marcus respectively. Congratulations. Thanks for watching this week's episode of Coffee Fusion. Remember, if you haven't already, like Coffee Fusion on Facebook, follow The Coffee Fusion on Instagram and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Remember, Coffee Fusion is bringing coffee lovers together.